Welcome back, everybody, to Torment Simulator 19 here on Gogress Valley 19. Your host, uh, we're not the most, Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, how y'all doing? Larry, how you doing? Oh, shout out to my cousin there, Larry. Um, he's been talking about me playing this and stuff, so yeah. It's all good, don't worry, it's all good. Folks, today we got the FDR logging uh, beast here, and uh, this this video is going to be all over the place just to let you know off the top here. There's supposed to be a way you tilt this forward. There we go. Ah, we're talking. All right, now let's see this uh, tilt back. Oh no, I want. It's the uh, left side. Um, hello, Jill. Somebody? Oh, there we go. Alright, don't look like I'm going to get pretty much in this. Um, close. No. Close. Hmm. There we go. Once you learn the controls, it gets easier. Uh, it would be one that's not in there. Come on. I don't care how you're going, you're going. But put the tension belt on this. Oh Lord. I created a monster. All right, tension belt. Oh. Okay. Uh, can I restart this? <laughs> oh lordy, that's gonna be a mess. Maybe that's why this sawmill ain't doing too good. Go ahead and lock that back in place. Now this sawmill ain't doing too good because it's way up in the mountains, and nobody wants to drive their load up here. So, I'm afraid we have bad news. Uh, it's going to be going out of business. Uh, why are you not? Anyway, let's see what we can get on here. Uh, open the mouth back up. Tilt forward. Yeah, I see right now we're going to have to get the oven back up here and do some cleanup. Anyway, I just want to get some logs in, as you can see. Up there, I'm minus $127. So, yeah. Um, I got to go through. Is that all the wood that's sold? And yeah, hop out of this. Oh, okay. That's tricks and say, I need more money than that. It's all about the money. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Let's see if we can get some of these in here. Uh, come on. Come on. <clears throat> oh. Ooh, 11,000. See? I just wish people would bring their logs up here. It'd be so much better. Anyway, folks, we got more construction work we're going to do in this episode. We're waiting on the the grass to dry so we can get to hay and all that fun stuff. Get this little kick. That's really hung in there. Okay, I got to get something else up here to load this. We might go ahead and let this baby go back. And the money we sell for this will go towards the loan on the sawmill so yeah be right back folks with something a little bit better all right we're uh, down here at the construction site look like they done moved the cat they're loading out some more dirt so that's good I like they got a little bit further back too on the stone 
Well, yeah, because the rocks that was here are gone. So that's good. And our job is to load out this stack of wood here and get it out of their way. So yeah, hunky-dory time. Let's load up some wood and uh, this goes to uh, the old sawmill. One over by, uh, over that way, yeah. So I want that to be on the front there. And try to change sides. And should be able to load now. Uh, or we not load. There. I probably had it on the right side to begin with and I switched it. Let's try it now. I bet you they left some bark on here. Oh, oh me, oh my. Are there any limbs? I don't see no limbs offhand. Ah, yeah, there are some. Oh, I need a chainsaw, please. Thank you. Get these little twigs off here. I had to get on them about not be living on like that. I gotta get all the branches off. This seems fine. Alright, let's see what we can do now. Always wanting to get on that side for some reason. Nope. Switch back over. Is it because I got the course play over? Um, that should be loading position right there. Swap sides again. Huh. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. there we go. Button in the right position or something. Want some of those on the front now. Okay, well, we're going to put some on the back. Ah, uh, it's going to be an ugly load. I see it right now. I guess we'll just load what we can on the back or front. It looks like we should be able to get it off. Oh, it would fall off. Okay, got one. Probably still got some limbs on it. Oh, that looks pretty good. Oh. If I give it a kick over. Boy, I just can't budge that now. Oh. But this is part of the farming, folks. Even logging. Some things go wrong, some don't. Try to get a little bit closer, see if that helps. Now, where did that come from? There we go. Okay, and we're going to strap it down. We're going to take it to town. You can tell it's lunchtime and nobody around doing anything. I need to get my other trailer, but I'll come back while I'm not loaded. We're going to move over to, I think it's field 12, the one we bought in the last episode. And start de lemon or we're just gonna harvest some trees over there, folks. And uh yeah. But those logs on field twelve, they're ours. So we can take them wherever we want. I'm gonna take them up to the top uh sawmill, our sawmill and See what kind of money we can get for them while we're there. May it be enough to pay that loan back and we can save the sawmill. Don't know. Boy, this thing's loaded. Don't want to turn. One up these hills. Alright, folks, I will see y'all at the sawmill. Alright, since I'm on the highway here, I'm just going to curve down this way. Come in the back where I guess you can see.
Whoa, whoa, whoa. Easy, easy. All right. Don't hit the overpass. Okay, good. About right there, just in case that train gets back around before I get. All right, that should do it right there. D strap. Come around here and we're going to sail. Oh, we're we'll going to get it, folks. Oh, God, that's a messy front there. 39, power 45, bringing us back up to 51,000. Oh, man. Forgot about these. Oh, let me just pull up some. It's a tiny bit, all it takes. All right, we're up to 54, 729 now. So, uh, let me go back get my uh, trailer. I'm going to drive this over to basically your farm shop. I'll be right back, folks. Now, folks, that is a nightmare waiting to happen. But it might be better than what we've been dealing with. So, let's just ease over here and see what we can do. I would love to get up to 100000 or a little more. So we can pay that back on to the, the sawmill. Got a squeeze up in there. I'm going to back up over it. Alright. Open these calls up. Oh, that worked better than anything. Alright, we're going to see what one grapple will get us. So, yeah. Of course, I'm going to be over here getting some more. This is where I need a blade for this thing. But I can push some. I just don't want to push too much. End up breaking a tooth off or something in the grinder here. Alright, money's starting to go up. I'll keep an eye on it. Whoa. That's a pretty good pile there. Oh, no, 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 no. I'll get back. Up to 80,000. 88. All right, 27,736 for a grapple pool. One more, and we should be at 100,000, folks. Go ahead, move that over. All right, try to back up to the high spot here. Do we have a... Yes, we do have a backup camp. Yay! Oh, didn't work like I wanted it to there at the time. Alright. I want to squeeze it, but not squeeze it too tight, because then it's going to start doing a heebie-jeebie, or what do you want to call it. This thing would be awesome if it had the winch on it too. Now we can pick up a load and pull a load too. Oh, that one fell off. Shucks. And by the way, folks, I am playing on a new controller thanks to uh, Mom. Uh, we got one of those checks in. That's all I want to say. That check. I ain't going to say the name of the check, but, you know, the good check. Uh, and she asked me, is there anything... In, oh, I went the wrong way on the call. Anything in particular what we want? And uh, I said, I can use another controller. And I go get it. So, it's... Uh, forgot the name of it. But it's White Camo. It's the only one they had in stock. Lady said they probably wouldn't get no more black ones in for a couple of weeks. So I'm like, oh, really? Really? So, and anybody that knows me, I don't like waiting. I'm trying to get some batteries for my, uh, for my, uh, for Lucille, my, my baby. If y'all know what that means, if y'all ever name your uh, guns, 
Uh, it's my Glock 22C. I got an internal laser for it, and come on, man. Is there? Yeah, that's our way. Okay, swing, baby. There we go. Swing. Yeah, there we go. Uh, but anyway, it's got an internal laser, and it carries three of the 393 volt batteries. Those little babies are hard to come by. Um, if you buy them one at a time, they're pretty expensive. Um, for about three, four dollars for one. But if you buy a 10 pack or so, they're pretty cheap. You get a 10 pack like seven, eight dollars. But, uh, it, it's just hard to find them. Uh, Amazon said they was out of stock on them. And Walmart carries everything but them. I have bought them at Walmart before. That's how I know, you know, if you buy one at a time, it's kind of expensive. Oh, I'm lifting the whole back end up. Okay, unstrap and open the claw. And go forward. Oh, come on. I think I can pick those up by hand. They're little. Let's see what I can do here. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, I thought I had both of them there for a second. I'm like, whoa, look at there. Um, there you go. Get in there. Pick it up this way. Be a little bit better. The uh, machine's too close. But, yeah, uh, uh, trying to find some of those batteries, but I just get my laser back working on my little baby there, and, uh, well, it's not little. Glock 22C is a full-size gun. Uh, 17,000, all right. Um, let's see. I'm going to turn this back on. I'm going to take out a couple of these. If I think about it, uh, if we do drop logs, we can just drop them there and work on the inside and have that one on the outside down there. And this will work pretty much better. Our money's still going up. Time we get the rest of those logs in there. We might have about 160 maybe. And yeah, so I'm gonna finish doing this folks. I thought I had the time sped up, but still one. I'm gonna speed it up to five. I'm gonna finish picking up all these logs and putting them in there. And then uh, we'll find something else to do as soon as I get back. So be back in a few minutes. Couple of seconds for you. All right, that's not the last of them, but that's a little bit more going through. I got onesies here and there. Pretty much three logs left. Want to see if I can scoot those together. Kind of back up like this here. Get that down like that. I'm going to use the tension belt and try to back it up. That's this one. One forty-six, folks. We're getting on up our tension belt on those two. And see if we can get the boat raising on up some more. That's unrealistic looking, but unrealistic. Can't talk today. I ain't too familiar with this thing. And, and yeah, it's just it's one of those things, folks. Just have to deal with Mr. Blue. All right, let's see if I can back up just a little bit more. Go down. Chomp it a little bit here. About like that. Strap it. Raise it and go. Last of the logs up here. Unless we get some more customers, it might be just us supplying the wood. So, if that's the case, it'll probably go out of business pretty soon, folks. So, 
I don't know. We'll we'll see what the outcome is. Raise it. There we go. If we do keep this place or able to keep this place, I want to make a little bit higher ramp here. This works out pretty good this way. Let's go that way. Open that up. Unstrap. And wow. Last of the stubbles. Or whatever you want to call them. I guess it'll help if I go forward. I'm going to go ahead and park this thing under here for now. Let the claw down a little bit. Let's go ahead and close it. I'll go and let that down and well on level ground we'll be able to check the oil and stuff in it next time we'll gotta put some fuel in it um gotta get these buckets off here claw all right not too bad almost 150,000 oh I forgot we, we got to uh sell some uh Solage bales. I get it straight here in a minute. I don't know if I want to use that trailer or this trailer. I might use this trailer to haul that thing because uh, that's getting sold. I, I can't remember what that thing's called, folks. Save my life, but the beast back here has got to go. So uh, probably in the next episode, you'll see how much you get for it. So yeah, all that's that. Let me be right back. I'm going to find the uh, skid steer and sell some uh, sellage bales. Be right back. All right. I came across this first, so we're going to sell these first here at the barn. We need the money, folks. So, uh, yeah. I uh, forgot how many we had. We're shy of two from having a full load, so here we go. Try to make it through here. The chicken pen's kind of throwing us off there. We need to do some more leveling there. Alright. Uh, yeah, our trailer's not leveling here, so it's not selling quite right. Okay. Last of it. So I don't know what I started out with, but... Uh, yeah, that's what we got so far. That's instant cash. Um, uh, let me go into our hood here. All right, right here, uh, sold bales. $6,579 for that load. I just don't think that's very much there, folks. But anyway. All right, I found our little putt-putt. We're going to be... Uh, putting these into the BGA bunker so uh, probably do a time lapse of this and uh, yeah meet you right back Alright, 
folks, I'm going to go ahead and end it here because we're waiting on the BGA bunker here to go down. As you can see, it's trying to go down, but it's just eating the bells as we go along here. So it's going to be a little bit. We got that much left. Uh, bring you back the next episode at midnight so you can see how much we get for these. And, uh, yeah. I got a loan to pay off, too. Oh, my. I forgot. Yeah, I forgot I, I bought Bill 12, and we went and loaned 150000 to help pay for that. But we also got some contracts I can get somebody to help do two fertilizing one. Uh, this one here is already done, so we're going to do that. And uh, we'll try these transports, too, maybe on the next episode. So, folks, uh, I hope y'all enjoyed it. I kind of had fun. I had to go buy a flint weight because it's 3,300 kilograms or whatever it is they call it. And plus, we already had that. We just haven't got around using it. Uh, so, yeah, that's going to be pretty much it. I got to get a trailer down here so I can get the Bobcat, uh, not Bobcat, but uh, the New Holland Skid Steer back to the farm or where we need it next. Uh, since we have the BGA now, or leasing it, I want to go ahead. They said we can fill up one of these. You know, it's basically ours as long as we're leasing it. But if we ever decide to not lease it anymore, whatever's remaining would not be ours anymore. So uh, that was fair warning. Uh, part of their rules running this. But yeah, but we'll get some. Yeah, folks, so this is what happens when you use seasons in the game and the trees ain't supported. They look like, uh, I don't know what that looks like. Is that how toilet paper's made? I'm just kidding, folks. Well, we'll get some uh, liquid digestate and plus money at midnight. So we're going to fill this stuff up with some chaff or grass or something and let it turn into silage and sell it that way. But folks, thank you once again for watching. I love each and every one of y'all. Be sure to leave a comment, a like, uh, share me with your friends. Um, 564 on the subscribers, the family members. Uh, I appreciate each and every one of y'all for that, folks. And uh, try to help me get up to at least 600 for uh, the month of June. And July will try for 700. Uh, might not make it, and we might, never know. Time for me to some bills. Anyway, y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I will see y'all later. Bye.